Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dork's Dally. The sword is here. Dork's Dally. Here it is. Here it comes. Coming right at you. See how long we can sit here just smiling. Well, I'm smiling. Are you smiling you're inside? Smile too, like, here's one of the things that happens when you get old. When you get old, your face is like sometimes out of control. So I'm your excited. resting face is a little off. Like, you know, you see old men, they're sometimes like. Well, when you see that, that's just like old resting face. And well, it's we're like, smiling. What's that have to do anything? What do you mean? We're not resting face. We're smiling. No, well, well that I'm was smiling, my resting face. Not... I wasn't smiling. Oh, yeah. I thought yeah. you were just being I'm miserable. Say, no, that was a normal face. Oh. That was just me being normal. I was like. Like, how does that happen? What, why does that happen? If anyone knows, let me know in the bottom. Nobody there. knows. But my blanket's done. I have to wash all the blankets before we go. We cover our furniture with blankets because of Lily and our furniture is like almost white. Yeah, yeah. For some reason. Right. But yeah, guys, we are so excited. We're leaving tomorrow on Princess, the we Enchanted are. Princess. Sure. I like, we just got home. We stay late tonight. We had to get everybody cut. It's possible. Yes, they're back to school cuts. So it's like a whole thing. Well, we're taking off the week before back to school. Yes. So. People are having breakdowns. Like moms are all like in connection. Well, I let everyone know way in advance. No, I'm saying moms are all like, did you get a cut? Did you like, there's a whole thing going on. I know. On. It's like drama. Back to school Crazy. drama. Back to school drama. But we still have a lot to do tonight. So let's get to this. We have today. We have five people struck by lightning. <gasps> yeah, you guys see, see that? I don't play games with lightning down here. People in Florida five generally people. don't. Struck by lightning in Phillipsburg, St. Martin, okay, on Wednesday. At 1.15 on Wednesday, okay? Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, two people uh, had minor injuries and reboarded the ship. And the rest of the people, they had to go to the hospital. Yeah. So, well, the, those two people might have went too, but they were able to reboard the ship. The other people, no. So three people had serious injuries. Wow. Serious injuries. So get, that's like, horrible. Struck dead on hit. Like what I don't happened? know anything about it. I just know three people had serious injuries. Two were able to get back on the ship. That's so crazy. prayers go out to all those people. Why are they playing Very around terrible. the water during a storm? Why didn't they get them out of the water? But five yeah. people. That's yeah, so five crazy. people in St. Martin. So that's very unfortunate. They were in the water. Were they all in the water when they I got struck? I believe they were. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. Like once you hear lightning, get out, or thunder, you gotta go, go, go. Thunder, there's thunder, come on. Yes. You know what I mean? Yes. Like, that is very unfortunate uh, for those people. Hopefully everybody's okay. And even though they were seriously injured, hopefully nothing's life-threatening. Yeah, hopefully they live. Yes. What else do we have? Okay. We Alaska. Alaska, Alaska, I don't know. <laughs> Alaska, and you know Alaska, they're going to get their fifth cruise uh, terminal dock, whatever they call it, they're going to get it. Even though uh, there was a lot of protesting going on and people didn't want it and all the activists or whatnot were trying to stop it and they were not successful. So it's a go. So they're getting another cruise port in uh, Juneau. Juneau, Alaska. <laughs> so another- Is it Norwegian? Another dock. Just random, yeah. Just Alaska's like, getting it. They're just, they, they, they didn't want another there. one. They didn't want more ships coming, but they can't stop them. Ships are coming in. Yes. And what else do we have, too? Something, it's not like, I don't know. I guess this is news. Yeah. The Disney Treasure. We've been talking about Disney a lot. I don't know. It's in the news, okay? The Disney Treasure is set to enter service for Disney later this year. And it's the sister ship to The Wish. So if you're familiar with the Disney Wish, it's going to be, like, very similar. It's going to be sailing out of Port Canaveral, the inaugural sailing, on December 21st of this wow. year. So it's going to be a Christmas cruise for the first sailing which is actually, I think, pretty cool because they'll have very the cool. ship all decked out Christmas. They hook it up. That'll be like a very special cruise. God, I, I mean, Disney's Christmas how much cruise you think that are is? insane. <laughs> it's like a winter wonderland. How much do you think that cruise is? Eight grand. Billions? Two. I say billions. No, I say billion you have dollars. to sell your home. Trillion. To go. That's crazy. It's crazy they charge that much. I don't know how much it is at and all. People go. I guess they sell out these cruises. I don't people, know. Many people have, that's nuts. I don't know. I, mean, I know they come from everywhere, but whatever. But it's pretty cool, though. The theme of the ship. I like these themes they do. I actually like a good theme. I'm like a theme yeah, person. Yeah, I like a theme. And the theme of the Disney treasure is adventure inspired. Okay? And the decor and live entertainment uh, will be 
incorporating all the classic Disney stories like Aladdin, um, The Jungle Book, Coco, and Zootopia. Coco. Yes. I like Coco. I forgot about Coco. I like that one. The Jungle Book. Um, what was the other one? Zootopia, The Jungle Book, and Aladdin. I don't know. Maybe Zootopia. more. I, that's just like... Oh, Zootopia is It's going to be adventure-based. That's Chris Rock's Zootopia. Yeah, there's right? like a Actually, zebra and the lion. and, and I, I never really watched it, but I've seen What was the bits. other one you said? Uh, Jungle Book. Coco, The Jungle Book, and you Zootopia. Know, I think I've never seen Jungle Book. The Jungle Book? I don't know. We were very... It's an old one. I should watch it. The Jungle Book's an old one. Um, here's some of the features on the ship, though. Let's see what we got. Grand Hall features Aladdin and Jasmine on their magic carpet. Okay. The Haunted Mansion Parlor resembles a ship parlor with ghoulish drinks. I love that. But I want the other one back. Okay. I like the other ship back. The Scat Cat Lounge is inspired by the Aristocats. Mm -hmm. Okay, that movie. Um, Periscope Pub is a submarine theme. Okay, bar inspired by the 1954 film, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. That's, that's Disney, I believe. Yeah, so, I yes, everything's Disney. Disney. Mm -hmm. So, that I like these themes for the bars. I do too. I think it's pretty cool. I like them too. And uh, what else? Oh. It's funny because people are going to be getting drunk, like all Disney'd up. Like, or do they? Or do they just kind of go No, I mean, leave? I think it's funny that the things I read are more about bars and stuff for Disney, which I would think wouldn't be a focal point for them. I've had people them. That. I've had people so, tell me it's very, like, adultish. And then they have the Plaza de Coco, which is a restaurant with recipes from the Rivera family kitchen. Wow. So, you know, the movie Coco, I guess it's uh, recipes are inspired by that movie, maybe, like, their culture, what they this would is, have. That's Mexican Coco, right? I think so, yeah. So, so it's not the Rivera family. They don't even... Rivera, they're, they're that's... Cartoon no, that's their last name in the movie. I know, but those people don't have a recipe book. No, but it's supposed to be like that. That's nice. So it's, it's a good fun. Mexican theme. People love Mexican Yes, theme. but isn't it more People fun to it. pretend you're in the movie? That's the whole point yeah, of I the do. ship. I do. I'm a sugar... Themes. They call them okay. sugar skulls. Sugar skulls. You like sugar skulls? That's what they call them. What's the skeleton skull? Yeah, the ones? lady ones? No, like the dude, like the cool ones. Like I think the ones. sugar skulls are just girls. Like the pretty... Um, I need tax on this one. Listen, sugar skulls are like pretty skeletons. I don't know if men are included in that. Are there men sugar skulls or is it just women? Skulls. Is it just the, for the ladies? Let me know, guys. Tex, if you're watching, we need to know. Sarah, we need to know. Okay. Then they got Jumbo. Someone's going to Google it and then attack us. I'm actually just calling one person out for that. But I'm just saying, like, oh, yeah. this one gentleman is going to Google it, find out, and then, like, attack us on the comments and which pinky on it right now i, I i'm a down with it I'm, I'm not against you no i'm winning i win what are you gonna win because i agree well i thought i could win it we're gonna bend that hat on it okay so i can add <laughs> anyway jumbo sweets is a sweet treats inspired by zootopia like venue so basically a candy place okay they're going to have Paul-shaped shortbread cookies, leopard-spotted cakes, and edible chocolate postcards. Wait, what's that? It's going to be like a, a sugar sweet plate. Wow. Um, and it's just going to be inspired. Like, they're going to have like animal-themed cakes, like a there. leopard cakes and stuff. And Paul, yeah, yeah. Paul print cookies. So, so How about yeah. MSC when they had the one ship had all those crazy cakes? I don't know. We had chores in Disney World, and it was one of the worst things Churros I've ever bought Churros. in my life. So, I was ashamed. It, and you can't, I feel like you shouldn't be able to mess up a churro. But let Especially me tell you Disney something. shouldn't. We were so excited too for these I was, churros. I was we were like, this is so great. We went and sat down. We even like on a little, like wherever we were, we're like, we're going to eat these. Yeah. We were like, dude, I think we like threw them away. I did. Well, we taped it. They were not good. Like, yeah, I rarely throw things out, to be honest. Even the worst. I'm like, this is terrible. Yo, remember the churro dude up in Jersey? At the flea market mm -hmm. up in, oh my God, this guy yes, would give Berlin. you this, like, Berlin flea market. Berlin. If you're ever up that way, besides the tomato pie, you got to go get the um, churros. Churros dude. at this, like, like walk around this you flea, find them. indoor flea market, which but doesn't look outside. like, it doesn't look like much. No, he was inside. No, he was outside, the churro guy. Well, what are you talking about? 
The one in Jersey, not the one, the one not the, Gordon. The one was a motorcycle robot. Not Columbus. No, Gordon, Columbus. Not there. No, no. Columbus, yes. Jim, you got them mixed up. Oh, you're, you no, that's, up. they're no way near as good as no? what I'm talking about. You're talking about the one that was in that weird mall that's like a Berlin. Thing. That's no, Berlin. You probably didn't get them. Oh. Me and the kids got them. Oh. There's a dude that sells them and he just puts a pile of them on the thing. Oh, I never had them. I don't caramel know. and chocolate sauce. I asked for both because I'm fat and he gave me two full sides He's and like, you just you sit there and them. dip and dunk and I'm like, Oh my extra, god, extra. how do you not remember that? Yeah, but I'm just saying. They're you're... the ones, remember when we were asking people from California, because they were like, I was like, yo, do your churros have filling in them? And they were like, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But here's the thing, though. You're at a random flea market oh, in yeah. the middle of nowhere in New Jersey, oh, yeah. and you can get a good churro. But you're at Walt Disney By an Indian World. Lady. An Indian family. Yes. You're at Walt Disney World, which is like a multi-billion dollar Oh, you're right. Oh, my God. Yeah. And you're charging me like $20 for these churros. How dare you? And they? they are disgusting. No, and you're right. Why? That ladies, if she why? had those churros, people would go there for those Oh, churros. my God, yes. I just don't understand right. why you would have... Disney should not have any bad food. It should all be good. Like, you're right. Those churros might be better than Berlin's. But Berlin gave you so many. They didn't have yeah. any filling in them, though. Berlin gave you the, the long ones. Yeah, they were like this. You know, yeah, sometimes yeah. they're real long, and yeah. sometimes they're like the mini shorts. Oh, these were just giant ones. These like, were like real over. long, like yeah. real long, like six. Man, I ate so many. I was probably God, that's so bad. But you know what? The ones at the mall she's talking about, they gave you like maybe like four of them. Yeah. They had filling, like a like a cream filling. Some of them had fillings. They had plain ones too, but some of them had fillings. But yeah. But people from Mexico and people from like California, where churros are more popular and that's where they come from when you tell them about filling they're usually like they don't do that you know i don't want filling by the way that's a metagon i thing. want my churros want just cinnamon sugar coated that's it give me a filling i don't want any filling in my churros i don't want no fake weird caramel i don't want a raspberry delight no how do you not like the caramel uh-uh i don't want it because it's thin it i don't say the raspberry it. stuff that's like too it's sweet. too sweet i listen mm. i it's not that I don't want anything, anything sweet ever, but I just want minimal sweet. I don't need like extra sweets. The caramel is so good. Though. I don't want it. That it makes me a little I'm like. I'm still mad about that. We're, we're still like upset about it. We can't churros get past churros. Churros something you get on a kick for, don't you? Churros, you like. We can't get past churros. Well, I'm a no. big cinnamon toast fan, okay? Yeah. I love some nice uh, rye bread uh, with some butter and cinnamon sugar uh, on top. I'll just eat that. That's like. A, I like that. The churro cereal's better. Remember the churro cereal? Remember the churro cereal? It's a good oh, movie snack. Oh, boy. It is. Right? You buy them put some and of them put them in a sandwich Ziploc bag. And go party. Put it in your purse. You're good. Right, you, instead of spending all this money on, like, popcorn and yeah. stuff, you get some awesome cereal and go get a one. Now a box of cereal is nine bucks, so you can yeah. probably better off getting the cereal from uh Well, why the, the candies? Probably What's the popcorn cheap? cost today? Oh, God only knows. We haven't been to the charging. movies in so long, but we got to go see that one movie. What movie was that we have to go see? Oh, my gosh. So many. I want, I'm no, we wanted to see, see something. There's something we said we had to see in the movies. I can't remember. But anyway, oh we'll have to what check out it? the popcorn prices we were while we're there. Movie, right? I can't remember. I can't remember anything, guys. I have so much going on. It's crazy. Yeah. I still have to. Jim has to dye his beard. I have to finish packing my shoe bag. Okay, I have to get all my fluffies in a row. Get all the fluffies in. All right. She's got a bunch of fluffies. And I got a bunch of croc slides. She's got a bunch of fluffies. I got fluffies, fluffies and I have to bring a normal shoe, too, because, like, I have to be normal I have to bring point. a shoe, too. You're bringing my shoes. Your boat shoes, yes. So, guys, we have to go finish packing, and we do. we're going to go live from the ship tomorrow. I'm not sure when. At some point, we'll go we're live. We're trying to go live a couple times, right? Well, we're definitely going live tomorrow. So yeah. if we don't go live after that, at least tomorrow we're going live before we sail away. So or yeah, look out, out for that tomorrow. And we're going to try to do our dailies too on the ship. So I don't know how it's going to work. I don't know how good the internet's going to be. Do you but mean the we're dorks try to do daily dailies. you want to do on the ship? We're going to try. The dorks daily. We're going to try to. I don't know if we're going to accomplish this. So like yeah. there's no promises, but we're going to attempt to do it every day. That's right. We're going to try. So yes. We're going to do our best. We're going to try to do a video every day from the ship. Maybe go to different places on the ship. Maybe just in our room. That's what I don't know what's going to happen. Or like walk around. I wonder how the internet's going to be on that ship. Yeah, like it all depends on how the internet is. But guys, we're going to see you tomorrow. Big we have boarding tomorrow. day tomorrow. It's cruise day tomorrow. 
so excited. Have a good night. Have a great weekend. And we'll see Fort everybody Lauderdale tomorrow. Out so far. There's a hurricane coming. Oh, yeah, we got to drive to Fort Lauderdale. Check out the hurricane. We might get, like, whisked away in this They already cycle. said we're definitely going, and we might go in the hurricane. It's a new cruise feature. They're going to go into the hurricane. The hurricane experience. Yeah, it's called the hurricane experience. Yes. How cool would it be? Look out for hurricane. that. I wouldn't mind some wild weather out there. You would, we'll hold on. We're going to be inside. I guarantee you this will be the cruise that we get the crazy weather because we're stuck in a room where we ain't going to be able to enjoy it. Damn it all. Damn it all, guys. It's an inside room. We never got an upgrade. It's Aww. all my fault. I give up. If anyone knows Princess, call them. Jim's going to get punished. Okay? Get us an upgrade Jim's on the know. list. If you know about the list, sucks. he's on it. See you tomorrow.